Hello there. I have achieved victory yesterday in the triathlon, at least the first round. So I want to relax with some Castlevania 3 because I had never beaten Castlevania 3. Being said, I'm going to turn down. Where's the capture card in here? I gotta turn that down a, at least a little bit. Settings. Yeah, I managed to win the first round, which I am very proud of. It was a uh, interesting setup. You may also notice I adjusted the layout. I've got a different layout now. I think this will ultimately work better since the game itself is in the center. I might make it a little less bland later, but that's what we're working with for now. And why is my controller suddenly not working? Oh, is it working now? Yeah, I guess it's working now. And we gotta go with the ever classic. Ah. Did Jacob design the icon? Uh, the one that I use on Twitch? Yeah. He made the icon. I guess if you know him in the style bar he goes for, it's not that much of a surprise. But he sent that to me, he's like, here, use this. I'm like, alright, I haven't changed my icon in a long time, so, sure. I like the look of it. So, I remember daggers. Practically useless. And, it's probably not, yeah, there's no wall chicken here. And nor is there any there, all right. Hi, Bat. I didn't need you to live. Jump. And this should be the third block now. No, that's, I'm still in the second block. Die, skeleton. It, had I had a, I had to play in the triathlon on hand, I would have uh, started with that, especially Fire Striker. Fire Striker was very interesting. It, I like Fire Striker for what I've played of it. Uh, can I? Thank you. But man, is it a weird game. I would have also started with a, with a Gradius 3 because I am. Still ashamed of my performance in Gradius 3 in that triathlon. Ugh. But oh well. I can't I can't even really complain that much because I won the round. So do I still have my right to complain? Probably not. <laughs> could have been worse. I could have been stuck with what the next group had. I had to deal with Pictionary. That, that's a nasty one to be stuck with. Ow. Stupid Hunchback. Stupid Hunchback! Alright, let's take all the dumb hits in the world. Because that's good. That's great. And it's exactly what I need before I have to fight the boss. Can I get a better sub weapon? Nope. We're working with the axe, and even less health now. Alright, well, we have the dagger. That might be helpful for its range. I thought I took a hit there for a moment. Is there a wall chicken anywhere? Nope. May not be dead. Nope, we are dead. Damn it! Gonna salvage that. Oh well, walk it off. With full health, 
taking down this guy is gonna be not a problem. Well, now almost full health, but at least a fully powered up whip again. That's the important thing. Having a really bat. Come on, come on. Okay, I was gonna say if that worked, I should I was gonna be incredibly disappointed. Bye. You go up in flames. I get my orb. We're all happy. Maybe just me. But I'm happy about it. Uh, I believe the optimal strategy was to go up to the clock tower. Ironically enough. But it's because I believe you get Grant going this way. And Grant's really good to have early on. I'll probably be switching off to, uh, Cypher later if we get that far. I don't know if I will yet or not. Uh, well, with how far I'm aiming to get, I'll probably at least get to Cypher. Probably won't get much further than that, though. Because I want to say it's stage 4 that I got stuck on when I played this last. Stage 4 is a bitch. Kill the skelly boy. Oh, this looks fun. Oh, it's just a jump. That's not nearly as perilous as I thought it would be. Is there any holy water nearby? I haven't found any holy water yet. You keep dancing, Trevor. You dance. Dance on that pendulum. Jump. And jump. Alright. Clock tower. Clock tower's gears. Oh, this... Okay. What am I worried about? It's only stage two. It's not like the game's gonna get super bullshit right away. It's gotta take some time to get to that level. What am I thinking? Back to the hunt for holy water and Medusa heads. Well, the hunt for Medusa heads is a, uh, a very easy hunt because they're everywhere. this near the boss? That's not holy water. Damn it. I want the holy water. I might need the hearts for, uh, for the boss. And I didn't realize I was on the stairs. Oh, good. More gears. It's like this is gear... Central or something. Ooh. I don't know if I should have lived that or not. Ah, there's one of the items. There's a double shot. I would prefer it with holy water, but... There I go talking about holy water again. No, like, sub-weapons are gonna matter once uh, we have Scythe. Yay! That's silly death. And I'm on my last life too, so I better at least get to Grant, because that should be the start of stage three. If I can get to Grant. Alright, we made that jump that time. I feel slightly better about myself. All right, Medusa heads, you can you can fly away now. And fly to somewhere that is far away from here. Easy jump. I I get it, Medusa heads. You like flying 
over and over again in my face. I'd appreciate it if you stop. That was close. Yeah, this should be right around where the boss is. Ah, there's the wall chicken. There's the pork chop. I think we need one more whip. Okay. To have it reach its maximum length, and we're apparently not gonna get that. Nope. Oh, there it is. There it is. Raiding time. Oh, killing you is gonna be easy. Hey. Bye. And that should be us getting Grant to join us. Yep. Hi, Grant. We will take him with us. It's very fast. You can control his jumping meter, from I remember, which is very useful in a Castlevania game. And you can climb on walls. use him for a bit. The one problem with him is, I believe... Yeah, he's only got a short-range dagger. Look at this! Look at this! We can easily control ourselves in midair. That in itself is really nice. Okay. So I just have to hold up and do that. Gotcha. That's how Grant works. Thank God for no falling damage. Oh man, I can't get down there. All right, fine game. Um, hey, okay. drop down. All right, I would have been safe either way. Uh, maybe not. All right, maybe I should get Belmont back in here. Uh -oh. Yeah, that's not the jump. That's also game over. Well, maybe it's better if I died then, so I could get my lives back. Let's try power. Okay, whoops, fully powered, so you're taking over, Grant. Alright. Yeah, I can't just stab that block, unfortunately. The other problem with Grant, I believe he takes damage a lot faster than Trevor does. So I gotta be, also be careful about that. Speaking of careful, or lack thereof, I think this is a, doesn't have a boss fight. I could be mistaken about that. Oh yeah, it's also apparently count as the second stage still. I didn't notice. So we're in block two five. Okay, come on, Grant. Well that works ish. Nope. Doesn't work anymore. Well, it's not a huge setback. Actually, can I just drop down here? Yes, I can. I should have done that in the first place. You walked on those stairs, Grant. Yep, there's the exit. Is that the ex- No, that's not the exit for the stage. No, because the pendulum's in there. So I'm like, maybe it is, because I don't see anything. But yeah, there's the pendulum. Well, getting back's easy enough. Okay, now we sh it should be, uh, there shouldn't be much in the way of, uh, scrolling stages. 
I didn't anticipate that, but that works. That's convenient. Convenient in my eyes. I don't know how poorly this will go, so... Safety measures! Ow. Ow. That's a good safety measure. Yeah, this should be the start of the stage, which should... Yep. And it's the end of stage two, officially. Stage three. Oh, boy. Let's pull you back out, Trevor. For now, platforming is not gonna be our- Aw, your web's back to normal. Oh, right, because I died. Yep. Owls of Doom. They're very... Doom-inducing owls. Can I stay docked here and be fine? Nope. Great. Alright, there's the whip boy powered. It's not gonna matter if I get killed by these owls! Come on! Alright, so they do two swoops. And then they're gone. Uh, might as well switch to you, Grant. You might be helpful. Mm, maybe not as helpful as I thought. Fuck. If I can get an axe, that would help. For this section. Die. I can't even reach you. Oi, swoop. Too low. These owls are gonna kick the shit out of me. Why? Why must it be owls? Oh, damn it, I timed that wrong. Alright, maybe patience will be the way to go. My patience was the way to go, although I'm on my last life, so... It's probably not gonna be worth it in the end! Yeah! Unless I can, by some miracle, beat the stage or find a pork chop or something. Well, the Hunchback's not getting me, that's for certain. Hello, this, uh... Skeleton. Yep. Skeleton got me. What a bitch. Hey, right, we might be able to deal with these owls somewhat better now. Mm, emphasis on somewhat. Hey, nope. Convenience. What's that? Oh, come on, owls. Go away! Oh, these owls! Ugh. What? Two owls just spawned in the same place. What's that bullshit? Talk about horse shit. Alright, come fly down here. Good. Good. Progress. We have it. We have progress. You can... Oh, come on. And now these owls are gonna kick my ass. It's not any of the Medusa heads. It's owls that kick my ass. Take down the hunchback. <sighs> oh, well, that went off without a problem that time. What the hell? Eh, take it and run. I jumped the gun.
I want to say this is also the stage we get Cypher. If so, that'll be nice. That was a stupid hit. Oh, good. Thunder. That's never on a ominous. Ominous. Oh, that was the end of that stage. Okay, yeah. So let's go this way. For Cypher. Oh, it's a continuation of stage three. I get it. But since I'm not fighting a boss, that also means it's not a full heal. It's only fighting bosses that are full heals. Uh, jellyfish! Jellyfish suck. Because you whip them, and then they split off into four projectiles, so you gotta center, you gotta time your whip slashes. That looks like stairs, but apparently it's not. Oh, speaking of whips, back the fuck up. No, no wall chicken, no pork chops. Well, that's sad. Oh, and spiders. Spiders that shoot spiders at you. Video games, am I right? I'll take the heart out. I'll take the full whip upgrade. Okay. Okay, spiders. Oh, that's a game of... Man, that is... That's brutal. All the way back to the owls. Alright, let's try being a little more patient with the owls then. I think by doing this, being more patient, we we'll probably have better luck with the owls overall. more time-consuming, but that matters not now, does it? Yeah, that was a lot easier. Uh, I took my sweet-ass time. So I'm going, I'm going into this section at full health. Alright, Skelly. And wait. And move. Shit. Above me. It's three shots and then go. Nice, nice. The punch back. Oh, another one of you. And you're dead too. And should be near the end of this block where we get the branching path. Yeah, through this door should be said branching path. Alright, that went pretty well. No hits. I'll take the lack of hits. Let's try this stage again. What could go wrong in this stage? Joyfish, that's what could go wrong. Well, if I don't attack him, I don't have to worry about the projectiles, it looks like. Oh, maybe I should be a bit more careful with that. I'm gonna jump over you. Oh, you still spit out the projectiles. Right, go, go, go. Not, not back up there, Trevor. Come on, Trevor, you should know better. Get out of here. 
Ooh, the axe and the spiders. That, that's a dangerous combo. Dangerous for them, not for me. I'm gonna keep this axe, thank you very much. You seem protected from these spiders. What? Is there oh, I see. There's stairs here. Makes sense, makes sense. And this is looking like a boss and a half. Oh, this guy. I'm always playing the Japanese version. You can't do anything to me from here. And if I was playing the Japanese version, I could climb on the wall with Grant. Because Grant has daggers by default in the Japanese version. Unfortunately, he does it here. He's just got his little stubby dagger instead of the sub weapon dagger. And with grace. Give me that orb. Hi, Saifa. Let's take Saifa with us. And this is where we part ways, Grant. My job is done, so you should go with him for now. Now for, I believe, the stage that kicks my ass. Yep, it's the ship. One reason the stage kicks my ass is, unlike in previous stages, there's a sub-boss that we need to worry about as well. I'm gonna want to get you... Right, this'll work for now. saifa has got really good magic abilities. And they are especially helpful for the boss. Jump. Clock, no. I'm gonna let you go away. Cypher's unfortunately got a uh, short range attack, but it's not a big deal. Just gotta make sure we've got the sub weapons. Like the magic to use the sub weapons. So as you can see, fire by itself. Pretty good. Ow, oh, come on. I'm taking more hits than I need to to. Let's do the smart thing. Use Trevor. That's the smart thing to do. But I'm not smart. Not smart enough anyway. Uh, at least we reached the checkpoint before my stupidity caved me in. Oh, crumbling blocks. Okay. You anything good? Yeah, you're just hearts. Hearts and more hearts. Are you alive? Or dead because you're a ghost? I don't need these candles. Money bag. Eh. It's points. I'm not gonna say no to points. Not that. Mind you. At least these red skeletons still only take one hit. Switching to Trevor's gonna be smart, because Trevor can take hits better than Sypha. Or I could do that. I completely forgot I still had that as my sub weapon. 30 hearts. That should be good enough to survive the boss. If we can get there without dying, that is. Something tells me that part's gonna end in failure. Yeah, it's only one heart to use magic, so. It's incredibly good. Ooh! Alright. Head. I'll 
player game. I've got a weapon that arcs too, motherfucker. Yeah, you better get back. Alright. Wall chicken? Dang it. I wanted that to be wall chicken. If I can find a pork chop, that will be the most helpful thing I could ask for. Ooh, that was an interesting sound. Oh, pendulums, huh? Mm, even better. Falling platforms. Falling platforms you gotta be quick on your toes for. I'm gonna wait for another cycle. Go! Go! And there's one that's going up. Nice, nice. That, that's fine. You can burn. Alright. Pork chop? Dang it! Why is there not a pork chop anywhere near here? And I, um... The sucky part is I'm pretty sure I'm coming up on at least the mid-boss. Nope. Yep. Here's the mid-boss. Oh, well. I forgot how easy you were. Ah, uh, but that's only the first half. The real annoyance is yet to come. I'm gonna preserve this life as long as I can, because having a fire spell... Very helpful. Mm, there's no pork chop here, unless... Unless it's the off chance that I'm not able to destroy those with Sypha. Yeah, it's just, it looks like I can, can at least still destroy this. I don't see why you wouldn't be able to. That would seem really weird if... If you couldn't. Oh, well, case in point, there was a pork chop right there. Back up. Okay, let's... Yeah, get rid of that candle. Wait, there's gonna be a guy right here, isn't there? No! Oh, there he is. I'm like, wait, wasn't there a guy there earlier? Yeah, he's there. He's just hiding. He, d he doesn't want to burn. Unfortunately, I, uh... I give him a sweet lava bath. Oh. These things. Seesaws! Seesaws are fun. Especially when you're seesawing over death pits. That's where it gets really fun. Oh, hi. I should be careful here. Because those crows, they can easily try to nail me. Well, they didn't. Uh, this guy, on the other hand. Yep, there's a hit. I'm switching to you, Trevor. So you can nail that crow, and you can nail that guy. So that, I believe, is a shortcut if, uh, if you have Grant, which unfortunately I don't. Burn the both of you. I don't know why I'm still trying to get hearts. Heart-wise, I'm pretty set for the boss. I guess I mainly want a better spell. Though the only spell I could ask for is Lightning Bolt. Oh, it's the boss gauntlet. Now I remember why I didn't like this stage. Oh, the mummies! Die. Alright, what was the other thing I had to deal with here? 
Oh shit, this this deck again. Now I remember why I hated this sage. Because in order to dodge this guy's attacks, you had to position your jump. Precisely. Yep. Now I remember. And now Sypha doesn't have a magic spell again. Sad. Very sad. Let's try to get that back. Ow! Oh, and Killer Yu's getting a pain as well. I didn't even think of that. I guess I'm tanking the hit now. Yeah, now I remember why I hate this so much. I'm like, wait, what? Why is this a big deal to me again? And then I remembered that one dick. It gets some hearts this time around. Oh wait, isn't this a? Yeah, this is a platform. It just blends in really well. I didn't realize that. Well, now I know. Shit. Ah, fuck. Okay. I was wondering when I would make that horrible mistake. You're gonna be best suited for us, Trevor, because you can take hits better. I swear to God, that knocked me off the edge. Uh, but this is where I gotta be careful, because... If I'm not careful... Oh, shit. Well, that works. Not what I plan, but it works. Give me that ma magic. That magic is mine. <sighs> All right. Unless, yeah. Pretty sure I checked last time whether or not there would be a pork chop, and there wasn't. All right, mummies. Ah, oh, come on. All the way back here! Uh, reasons why I don't like this stage. One game over. Enough to do all this. Shit. I'm gonna be stabbed. I can't believe I was not stabbed. Take that clock, Trevor. Why not? I mainly wanted to get your whip up to uh, maximum firepower, so that way it'd be ready for when I need it. All right. Best strategy: back up. That's not backing up. Okay, that's gonna be good enough. Makes sense to me. Alright, 4A down. We'll go to a game over and then we will uh we'll switch games. Burn the both of you. I love burning candles and getting a heart out of it. Makes you feel like you accomplished a lot. I wonder how long we can go in this stage without taking a hit. Hey! Well, that got disproved. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, game. Actually, this might be another good case to use Trevor. Never mind. Oh, you son of a bitch.
There. That's why I wanted to use you, Trevor. Should've done that in the first place instead of trying to climb up the stairs while he was still moving. I hate those red skeletons. Skeletons. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. And guess what? I get to go back to the red skeletons. And uh, on top of that, I don't have my clock anymore. Uh, I might be getting that game over faster than I think. Oh, definitely. Oh, come on. One of those days. It's one of those days for yelling at video games. I would not mind this stage nearly as much if uh, beating the mid boss counted as a game over checkpoint. The fact that it's not is what destroys this stage for me. It's already hard enough as is, but then you gotta throw in a mid boss, and after you beat the mid boss, you gotta throw in more stage. Like, what? Who thought this was a good idea? Alright, Trevor can take hits better. Go to him. Oh, and that... Of course! Of course! If I don't have the clock, I have no problem... Uh, isn't that how it goes? Shit. Well, that's the first hit for this life. Can you go away? I can't throw an axe at you anymore. I want you to go away. Alright. Whatever floats your boat. Hey. Don't get me started. Don't even get me started. Alright, the slowly descending platforms. I also just noticed I'm on my last life. And there goes that life. Well, shit. I'll have to attempt Castlevania 3 later then. For now, we are going to switch games.